name is Sal Nugent, and I'm here to tell you what you need to know about inclusion classes. Inclusion. What is it? Why do we need it? Who is involved? And what is its purpose? Did you know? The idea of full inclusion is beginning to take hold, and students with disabilities can now be found in an increasing number of regular classrooms on at least a part-time basis. What this means is an increasing number of students with disabilities and general education students will experience what it's like to be a part of an inclusion class. IDEA 04 is a law which protects the educational rights of students with disabilities. IDEA states that students with disabilities have the right to a free and appropriate education and that students should receive their education in the least restrictive environment, or LRE. This calls for inclusion and integration with typical learners as much as possible. What this means is an increasing number of students with disabilities and general education students will experience what it is like to be part of an inclusion class. What is an inclusion class? An inclusion class is a class in which special education students are taught along with general education students in a general education setting. Inclusion classes are composed of general education and special education students, a general education teacher, and a special education teacher. Occasionally, you may also see a paraprofessional in the class who assists and supports the special education program and may aid an individual student. The role of the general education teacher is to make sure the correct curriculum is being covered, while the special education teacher modifies the lesson so that the lesson can be understood by every student in the class. Modifications can be as simple as providing type notes to more complex such as differentiated learning techniques. Assistive technology may be used such as audiobooks or electronic organizers. The goal of inclusion classes are much like any other class. Teachers strive to provide better instruction. Inclusion promotes a higher self-esteem for all students. Collaborative teaching allows for closer monitoring on student performance. Thus, higher achievement should be achieved by all. And all students should learn how to accept differences and to feel accepted. There are a couple of things that can be done to make inclusion classes a very enjoyable and educational experience for all. Teach acceptance to every student. Express to students that everyone has gifts, talents, and challenges. Establish and enforce rules for the class. And encourage teamwork. Remember, as once stated by John Dewey, American philosopher, psychologist, and educational reformer, what the best and wisest parent wants for his child, that must the community want for all its children. And any other ideal for our school is narrow and unlovely. Acted upon, it destroys our democracy.